Hey, it's Ben here. In this video, I'm going to be doing a review of Becast. This is a new cloud-based app that allows you to run a podcasting agency business. Now, uh, I'm sure we've all heard of uh, podcasts and what those are. Um, and actually, the software here has helped a number of businesses already uh, make money from their own podcasts, as well as create podcasting services, such as uh, editing the podcast, uh, creating the content, uploading it, uh, syndicating it to Apple, iTunes, to Spotify, to all the places people listen, uh, like these here. And podcasts are becoming one of the biggest ways to uh, get uh, viewers right now, get listeners and leads for your business. Uh, in fact, you probably heard uh, Joe Rogan uh, just signed a deal to do his podcast exclusively through Spotify only uh, for more than uh, $100 million. So podcasting is kind of like the, the new big thing um, that's uh, you know generating some serious uh, revenue and uh, leads for people. And there really hasn't been any uh, softwares developed that help uh, small businesses uh, get a podcast up that you can create for them and sell them. So obviously like someone who's creating like a pet, who runs like a pet business or pet care business, um, to reach more leads, more customers and sell products, especially online products, you know, having a podcast would really help even if they're putting out like just one episode a week or every two weeks. But people, they don't have the technology to know how to uh, code it right to upload to iTunes or to Spotify nor do they have the time to actually you know, create the content for them. So that's where Beadcast comes in. It's gonna do the coding um, to uh, allow those people to, or, or you, if you wanna have your own podcast, to submit it to Apple iTunes to get it approved and submit it to Spotify and, um, and places like that, as well as create the content and edit the content. And you're also getting um, a, uh, uh, it will create like a, a podcast website for you that you can learn about. Uh, people can learn about and subscribe on there, a widget that you can embed on sites. Basically, it's sort of like an all-in-one tool to help you uh, start a podcast or or help other people get podcasts online uh, to listen to. Okay, so how's it gonna work? So this is, so um, it actually comes in three parts. Uh, the parts are called B Content, B Voice, and then B Cast. So what I'd recommend doing after I was uh, playing around with it is it seems that uh, if you wanna start a podcast from scratch, uh, it, it's best to start with B content. And this is gonna find content for the podcast. So say you're working with that pet business, for example, and they wanna get a podcast up to get uh, new leads, and they're willing to pay you you know, 300 bucks a month to get this podcast up. But you're not an expert on like cats or pets or animal welfare or anything like that. So what you can do is you can go to uh, B content, and you can search for videos. Now, uh, you can also, you can search by Creative Commons license like I've done here and find content already out there. Now remember, podcasts, they don't have to be like three hours long, like the Tim Ferriss show. A lot of them are just like 20 minute or, or 10 minute tips about something and people could listen to. And then there's like a, a pitch at the end that says, hey, go buy our new product or go opt into our list at the end, right? It's just like a little video. So what you can do is you can take content that people have already created here and edit it for your, yourself first. So here's one that says like, what, what happens when your cat calls up to you? So that could be a podcast episode. Like what means when you're, a uh, cat wants attention. So with B content, we can first uh, click here to create the post. And what it will do is it will take all the uh, the text from this video for you to go ahead and um, uh, use because it's Creative Commons. Or if you want, you can go ahead and like edit it and and make it toward the business. You know, instead of like 2015. Um, oh, this is like uh, they told someone in 2015. But it's something that says like, these are the best tips for 2018. You know, put it, these are the best tips for 2020 because it can, you know, it'll probably work. Um, and what you can do here is you can spin the content if you want, or you can just use it as is, as I would, and then make sure that it's all grammatically correct. So then what you're gonna do is uh, just go ahead and copy all this text and then head over to be voice to get the voiceover done. Now you can record a voiceover yourself or you can just quickly save time and have a uh, realistic voice uh, narrate it for you. Now, B-Voice comes with Amazon Poly, Microsoft WaveNet, Google WaveNet, or saved voices uh, that aren't credit-based. You can use this uh, as many times as you want. You just go ahead and, and paste your text here. Select the, um, uh, enter the name, choose the language you want, uh, choose the voice, preview the voice, Choose the voice that you want. Uh, preview the voice uh, if you need to. And then go ahead and save it and it will go ahead and create the audio file for you. All right, now that you have uh, the audio file, now you can go to Bcast and create the podcast. 
So what you want to do is you can go to over here to where it says create podcast and um, basically it will create something like one I already have uh, up here. And then we can go to this and uh, what it will do is it will, uh, when you go to create a new podcast, it will auto create your uh, feed, which you need to submit to Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts and all the podcast directories. So it's up everywhere. Uh, this is your hosted website. Now, like I said, it's giving you a uh, done for you website that you can customize and people can subscribe to and they can see all your uh, different podcasts on that website. You also have an embeddable player, so if they want to use it on their own website and people can listen to the podcast on that person's website. Then you go ahead here and create the episodes. Then you upload your audio to the episode or uh, the audio that you made yourself um, in the B voice. You can also add audio inserts. Now these are good because um, you know a lot of times people run ads in the uh, through the podcast like before we start hey make sure to check out you know ziprecruiter.com or whatever it is that they, they have at the, the start of the podcast you can add your uh, audio insert that way uh, this is the link to the website you can make it their domain if you want as well uh, you have social where you can go ahead and every time you pop you publish a podcast episode it will automatically update on social media so it looks like again a whole podcast agency system is working and then here's the directories. Now you can follow the instructions here and it will show you how to insert your directory here. So whenever you automatically create an episode, it'll be published to these different directories. Now remember, people can find podcasts from a bunch of different places, uh, not just Apple. And then finally, you can show them analytics, who's uh, downloading, who's subscribing, uh, who's uh, clicking and listening to the podcast so they can see that they're getting results from it, right? So basically, you know, pretty much uh, everything's here to get podcasts up and running, uh, including finding done for you content, creating done for you voiceovers, uh, editing the audio if you need to, uh, creating the audio, and then the coding here uh, needed to submit it correctly, uh, submit your submit your feed correctly to uh, Apple, Spotify, etc. So uh, overall, this is definitely a, a creative solution. Um, sometimes you know new apps come out and they're just you know copycat of the same thing over and over again. Uh, but this is an entirely huge marketing industry, voice marketing, that no one's really tackling or going after. So it's good to see an option here that's very inexpensive for a one-time price that can help you go in a different direction than everyone else is doing. Uh, so again, it's launching for the, the one-time price, and I'll be including a bunch of podcast-related bonuses you'll definitely want to check out. And uh, thanks for watching this overview. Hopefully this showed you what exactly Bcast does, what the point of it is, and if it's right for your business or not.